What is up, everyone? Welcome back to the Crypto Blitz, your home for your crypto fix. I'm your host, Ripple Van Winkle. Hopefully, everyone is having an amazing day. It's Wednesday. It's hump day, folks. Look. I like Wednesdays. I'm going to be honest with you. It's halfway through the week. I get to do my live show. I love doing a live show. It's tonight, 7 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. YouTube, Twitter, TikTok, you name it. I'm on there. I love talking with the people. I love going over the markets. I love answering questions. And I just love helping people. I don't think there's enough people in crypto that like to help others. I think a lot of people are concentrated and concerned about themselves, but not this guy. I like to help everyone get answers to questions that you may have out there in this video. We got to talk about mass amounts of XRP, not only on the move, but a mass amounts of XRP being scooped up and purchased by the whales. What is going on? Something's cooking, folks. I'm telling you right now, we're going to look at the AMM. That is the automated market maker. So many people made fun of it when it first came out. It hit low volume. It's not doing anything. Of course it did. Why wouldn't it? It's brand new. Guess what? Volume is spiking. Volume is shooting through the roof. Just like we thought it would. And we're going to see the same thing. Look, Ripple Stablecoin comes out. You hear all the same people saying all the same stuff, don't you, right now? No one's going to use the stablecoin. The volume's going to be so low when it comes out. Of course it is. That's like saying, you know, Ripple puts a stable coin out and you think all the money's just instantly going to go into it. It doesn't work like that. It starts to slowly come and slowly come and then slowly come. And before you know it, when you take a slow plus a slow plus a slow and you times it by five, it's all the freaking money, folks. A lot to discuss, a lot to go over. Without further ado, sit back, relax. Let's jump into a Bitcoin $60,081. It's currently down 3.92%. In the past 24 hours, Ethereum coming in at 2,529. It's currently down 3.94%. USDT and USDC both coming in at their dollar pegs as XRP. It's down a tad bit from this morning. Look, this morning we were at 0.583. We're now at 0.582. Am I upset? Nope. Do I know where XRP is going, where XRP ends up when this whole thing is said and done? Sure do, folks. And I got a chart, a beautiful chart. I actually want to show you because I like what they're talking about. I'm, I'm pretty much aligning with it. It's one of the better charts I've seen out there that I get the pretty close to alignment with. Total cryptocurrency market cap, $2 trillion, $132 billion. Now, folks, look. Your time to buy is going to come to an end. There are a lot of steals going on out there right now. Solana, a steal at these prices. I mean, it depends what we calculate on from here, right? How high this thing is going to get. You know, I'm all in with Solana. I own a lot of it. Cardano, buy AVAX by link. I think we get a little bit cheaper here. Polkadot, 100% of freaking buy. ICP is a buy. ARB, 100% of a buy. That's going to give us some nice returns once it finally starts to move to the upside. I mean, look, people are predict predicting ICP is going to get to like 300, 400, two, I won't say two to 500, but be conservative. It's eight bucks. A 10X from this is $80. It's definitely going to get to $80, folks. Like, we have a lot of room for growth for a lot of these cryptos. As month end comes to an end, you better get yourself an NFT. Look, you buy it today, you get paid out on the first for it of September. That's it. The more you buy, the more you get paid out. We set records on the ledger once again. We just keep dominating the space, folks. This is what a real project looks like. This is it. A real project. And now token is coming out on BitMart as well, September 9th. Be on the lookout for that. Unlike any other token out there, there has been no pre-sale for people to dump this token. No one has access to this token until 50 days at the earliest. You want to see what happens when a token hits a top 20 exchange and no one's able to sell the thing? To the moon we go, folks. To the moon we go. You better lock this thing early. I know what I'm doing as soon as this thing's list. I will be on Bitmart. I will be buying it because I have a feeling this thing is going to do a 10x off the freaking rip. I was going to say something else, but I, you know, I held it back a little bit. Based edge trades. I don't know who they are. I never heard their Twitter handle before. It's many followers they got. 13,000. They popped up in my feed. So when they popped up in my feed, I want to go over it. I just get confused. Someone just messaged me. My bad. So here you go. A solid bet with good chances to tough to touch targets is XRP. It is currently attempted to break out of a seven-year 
bullish pennant. This might be violent and short. Unlike what a lot of XRP army people will say, it's not going to 30, it's not going to 100, and it's not going to 589. Hey, look, don't shoot the messenger. I, I am with him, though. I don't think we're going to 100 or 589. 30, we could hit 30. It's a very, 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 very long shot. We're just talking about this cycle, folks. We're not talking about overall, right? This is just concentrating what's going to happen within the next 6 to 12 months. That's it. He said, keep it cool. Here are his numbers. Here are his charts. You can see his top bullish lines around that $7. We'll call it $8 for simple math here, right? He targeted a price of $7.77. Look. This is a very, very, very accurate chart. I like this. I like what he is showing. I like what he is putting down. I believe in this chart. I told you 75 cents by the end of the year is going to open the door to a $6 at a minimum XRP. If we don't get to that 75 cents region, you know, we're probably looking at more of this 1.618, which is going to put us around the 2017 all-time high, all the way up probably, I would say, to this 3.618, which is a little higher than $6, is what we will be looking at. You should not be upset about these numbers. You should not be mad about these numbers. If we see, and I don't say if, when we see a $6 XRP, you will have done a 10X. A 10X is life changing. Admit it or not, folks. A 10X is not being done in the stock market. Look, they say if you put your money in the stock market every seven years, it will double. You have a chance to pretty much fast forward here or speed up the next 30 years. If they say every seven years it doubles and you're doing a 6X, seven times six is 30. It's pretty much, you know, you working from 20 to 50. Are you working from 30 to 60 and you're going to do that all within the next 12 months how about that a 10x i'm here i'm ready look i know what i hold i've held it for the past seven years i am ready you need to make sure you sit down and you line up a plan to cash out xrp anders put this out let's give my man a little retweet right hand a little like he says growth of xrp locked in on the xrp ledger automated market maker it's looking good that's a good sign. Remember how long it took for the total value locked on Uniswap to skyrocket? I wonder how things are going to change when we get institutional adoption. And he's right, folks. How long did it take Uni compared to what's going on here? The AMM is doing amazing things. The volume keeps going up. It is looking absolutely fantastic. We are going to get to levels we never thought or even dreamed of on this thing. It's still fairly new. Institutions are still jumping in, but they haven't begun, actually. They're going to get in. Pay attention to it. XRP Drops put this out. The Duchess Bank emphasizes that crypto space will be a multi-chain world where the interoperability creates a butterfly effect where investors can access different kinds of products from different chains. Listen up. We thought that it would be a multi-chain world and therefore interoperability will become uh, very important in order to allow investors and clients to navigate through this uh, multi-chain uh, environment seamlessly and effortlessly. But importantly as well, we also see that interoperability has got a butterfly effect it leads to other positive effects too. So let's just take right, this uh, chain of uh, reasoning. With interoperability, uh, investors now can access effortlessly. He's right. That's it. That's as simple as it is. Look, this is going to be a multi-chain world. We already know that there is not one chain. There is not one crypto that is going to win all. There will be a lot of different cryptos that are going to win, that are going to succeed when this thing is all said and done. 100% about that. If you think XRP is going to be the only crypto in the world, if you think the XRP ledger is going to be the only ledger in the world that's powering payments, folks, you need to rethink your thoughts here. I am not saying that it's not going to seed. I am not saying that it is going to take up a large chunk, but there will be other players in the game. We're talking about a 10 plus trillion dollar problem. There is no way that the XRP ledger is going to eat all 10 trillion of that. If it eats 1 trillion, 10%, I will be ecstatic folks ecstatic but this will be a multi-chain world where uh, i'm 
I'm reading an article about whale, and I'm saying whale, multi-chain world. According to this, XRP whales have scooped up over 50 million folks. 50 million XRP in the past 24 hours, boosting your holdings by 29.5 million. We're seeing the whales buy. We're seeing them accumulate. We're seeing the whales move it off the exchange to unknown wallets, which is a very, very bullish sign. Something is cooking. Something is brewing. This thing is about to rip, folks. No pun intended. I'm telling you right now. We are going to see a massive push up before this year comes to an end. It's happening. It's going down. Where is that going to put the price of XRP? I don't know. Look, if we can get above a dollar into a dollar fifty range by the end of the year, 2025 will never have looked so beautiful. This will be like you finding like a 10 out of 10 there. You know, a beautiful girl, you're going to find a beautiful crypto. We get above a dollar fifty and we get into that 2025 time frame. Get ready. Something is uh, uh, some, something's coming. Something's cooking. I'm about to be buying a lot of XRP today. I'll tell you that much. I'm doing it over the counter. So don't you worry about that. But I'm going to leave it like that. Look, I'll see you tonight. Wash your damn hands. Be nice and be kind to each other. Ripple Van Winkle is out.